So here we are, a different game today. So uh, we're going to do a bit more traveling around Europe and see what the atmospheres are like in different stadiums. So we're going to a league um, game. I think I pronounced that right, didn't I? Um, game. At the Allianz Riviera. Here we are. See it right there. To watch Nice versus Mets. And I'll be very honest, I don't think I can name a single player. I know, oh, no, Mohamed Ali Cho. Mohamed Ali Cho. Atmosphere is very different here. I was expecting a little bit more. Uh, Nisa currently second in the table. But um, we'll see how it gets when we get closer to the game. We've still got half an hour until kickoff. Uh, we don't have tickets yet. So if this vlog doesn't continue, uh, it's because we weren't able to get tickets. If it doesn't get uploaded. <laughs> yeah, if it doesn't this. get uploaded. So here we are, the French Riviera. Well, not the French Riviera, it's called Riviera Allianz. And beautiful stadium. And a fantastic view as well, look at that. So we've got about 15 minutes until kickoff. Haven't had much of an atmosphere yet, to be honest. But I can hear a little bit now. Uh, we're gonna go inside the stadium just now. We'll see what it's like when we get there. Okay, so here we are. The game is about five minutes until kickoff. Uh, not quite what I was expecting, to be honest. over here you can hear them singing up there but for the small number they are they are quite noisy uh, now I don't think they've got the same culture that we've got back in England uh, with the away support but you're gonna love this wait till you see the away section there they are the Mets Ultras in full volume there's more police officers than fans and here we are kick off here at the Allianz Riviera there's another small section of these fans there Be small in number. Uh, 10 minutes constant singing. I've got, a, I've got an Apple Watch notification saying you're in a loud environment. And if Safe's, Safe's gonna pan the camera now and show you how empty the stadium is. So they're doing a good job. Oh, and this is our stand.
Mercy said there's no VAR on that. It's no penalty for Nice. The fans do not look very happy. That's the second time this game. So there we have it, half time here at the Allianz Riviera, Nice versus Mets. Nice have had quite a few chances in this game, but Mets, considering they're 15th in the table, uh, not a little uh, bad performance from them there. Uh, let's see what the second half has for us. And I mean, while we're waiting, I will tell you why I've decided to come to Nice. So recently I signed up to Mirror Travel Club and they send you weekly flights for super, super discounted prices. And this week they had a flight to Nice and back to Gatwick. £34, couldn't resist a little weekend getaway. Left Friday morning, going back Sunday, and I found this game here for nine euros. So I guess I couldn't resist. Nice versus Mets, flights from Gatwick to Nice and back, all for less than £45. If you haven't yet, make sure you sign up to Mirror Travel Club. Super offers, super deals, all over Europe, and even some of the Middle East. So here we are, start of the second half. Quite noisy, I think the Nice fans are really hoping for a goal in this half to maintain their position. Second in the table. back and forth between the home fans over there and the one, away from and the one fellow with the flag <laughs> getting feisty in here stewards lining up for what could be a potential riot I think it's the fourth one so far. I think the ref is actually sticking with this one. It's a penalty now for Nice. No VAR call. I think it might have been a clear penalty. I didn't have a very good view of it. Let's see what the celebrations are like here in Nice Stadium. The Mets fans are out in numbers here. Don't know where they've been hiding all game. What's that say? Okay, so I can't really understand what they've said, but it is definitely getting a bit toasty in here. The away fans are giving it a lot, even though there's just a few of them, and I hope fans are giving it straight back. Than that, I'd rather watch. Um, 
and that is the end of that video there. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Unfortunately, not the greatest of games, not the greatest of atmospheres either. It did pick up towards the end though. Hopefully, we'll be back at Anfield for the rest of this season. I'm not quite sure when, but hopefully soon. And uh, we're going to try and go more games around Europe and see what the atmospheres are like. Hopefully better than this one. Make sure you like, subscribe and drop a comment down below. With that, goodbye.